Wow. That's kind of freaky. There's a praying mantis on my bike. A baby one. Hello, everybody. This is your old friend, Mike Kaylee 7 Good old Mike Kaylee V2 coming to you from my ultra classic. It's a beautiful day. It's now 94 degrees Fahrenheit, where I am. This is the uh, 18th, I think, 18th of uh, June. I'm just a riding fool. Thank you guys for your input on the motorcycle seat. That video I was asking a question about comfort. Thank you, Bilma, for the shorts idea. I think I'm gonna give that a try. I had them years ago when I used to ride a, a, a racing bike. So I'll get a new pair maybe. I used to ride a racing, uh, what do they call it? Like a 10 speed, but you know, I had like 23 speeds or whatever. Made of carbon fiber. And you get the helmet on there and the gloves and the whole. That was me, in Hawaii actually. Until somebody hit my elbow with their mirror and that was the end of that. I don't know if I'm recording or not. I can't rightly say. I am. So I got my cruise control on. I got my hipster sneakers on. This guy's gonna back out right in front of me. You watch. Now, oh, there's nobody even in there. Good. It's too hot. I don't like the heat. I don't like riding in the heat. Do you guys like riding in the heat? 95 degrees Fahrenheit, do you like that? I don't like that. Somebody said, uh, don't complain as long as it's not raining. Maybe they're from Texas. And I don't like rain any more than anybody else, but I would like to have some Cooler temperatures would be nice. Just for a couple of minutes. <laughs> nah, I'm fine. Usually in the colder weather. That's when I'm happy. From uh, middle of September until the end of May. That's an awfully big riding season. 
I mean, I'm still riding now, so I guess you could say my riding season is all year. I just don't enjoy it as much. Oh, goodness gracious. So. I've noticed a lot of uh, Harley guys making moto vlogs lately. I've subscribed to at least four different Harley moto vlogger channels. Which is kind of cool. Now, here's a question. Am I a jerk because I subscribed to these Harley motorcycle channels, but I didn't subscribe to that one with the kid uh, doing it with Dan. I think that's what the guy's name is, doing it with Dan. I didn't subscribe to his channel. He doesn't ride a Harley, and that's partially why. His sense of humor didn't really do anything for me. Knocking on people's windows as he's going down the road, if that's the guy. I'm thinking of uh, it didn't really do it for me and then the speed issue I, don't, I just don't like watching people speed there is a Harley guy that I subscribe to but I don't really watch his stuff a whole lot it's Robert Robb he's a nice guy I've got nothing but respect for the man I mean he got killed in the line of duty and they revived him But I don't like the lane splitting videos that he ha he's always doing. It just seems cringeworthy. I, I just watch it. I'm cringing on the whole time. I don't like lane splitting, and I don't like watching videos of people lane splitting. It just doesn't do anything for me. I don't like people speeding. You know, crazy speeds. I don't know. If, if, let's say, for example, Triple X Deadhead went and bought himself a uh, Repsol, you know, one of those Honda things, a super duper awesome Honda that I, I wouldn't mind buying one myself. If he did, I'd still watch his stuff. But it's just something about watching somebody ride a motorcycle that you like to ride yourself it just makes it feel more like family, I guess. And there are some riders that I, I would watch. I don't care what they could ride a trike, a, a tricycle, uh, not a trike, a trike too. But like Smarter Cowboy, he he's got the scoot, and I love it. And uh, Suburban Rider, he's got that uh, Triumph, and I love that. And Bilma, he's always got some awesome new space age thing, and I love that. And just lately, I guess I've been so happy to see other people that I'm stoked, I guess. Oh, you bitch. All right, folks, this is my Kaylee 7. Have a good day. We'll talk to you later.